Hey, what's going on YouTube? Uh, first fish of the day. Small baby. Wanted to see if this yo mama was gonna work since the water's real green here. There it is. Just hook them. Oh, there it is, folks. Bass on the yo mama on three aug weighted, 116 ounce weighted. Um, offset worm hook. Let him back in. See what else we can get out of here. All right, here we go, folks. First one of the day. Nice fatty. The nice jigging on the trick worm. Sorry about that. He wants to flap himself free. But uh, this is what I'm using. 14 pound test from Triline. Trocar 3 eye worm hook. Offset worm hook with the bait holder at the tip. And let me get him back in there. Hey, what's going on, people? Ah, uh, as you can see, very first cast I threw out on the, I think it's the Yum. I'm sorry, the Berkeley Big Worm, 10-inch worm. That's what I got. I have been fishing the Havoc Pit Boss for about 20 minutes. Didn't hit nothing. Uh, then I switched up to the Yo Mama sorry to the yo mama from big bites which is uh the craw that crawfish profile and didn't land nothing and as soon as i switched to the good reliable worm got this nice little baby here you know not a the biggest of bass but still a nice sized bass for the bayou so uh here we go first number one Hopefully I get some more on film for y'all. I'll let y'all know the setup right quick as soon as uh, I get him in. Uh, you know what, let me go ahead and do that now. I'm doing the 10 inch uh, power bait Berkeley worm, power worm, on a three out troll car worm hook on a small bullet weight. Same setup as I usually use, just a different hook. Uh, these hooks, if you're around an academy, they're on sale right now. I think it's a five pack or six pack for $198. They're normally about six or seven dollars. Real good hooks, man. So, uh, go check them out. So, yeah, here we go. On to the next one. There we go, folks. Bass number two on a 10 inch Berkeley power bait. Power worm. Berkeley. Not the biggest of bass, but it's a, it's a bass. There it is. Little baby. Uh, I'm trying to see where I can throw him so he don't land right on top of the rocks. Maybe one second. A nice little puddle there. Hey, nose dive. Alright, on to the next. Alright, here we go, folks. Bass number three. The same setup. Uh, we got a bleeder on the same setup. Yeah, he's that's way down there. Right, I'm about to get my pliers. 10 inch uh, Berkeley Power Worm on a 3 out troll car worm hook. Small bullet weight. All right, get him unhooked, throw him on back, on to the next. All right, here we go, folks. First bass. Nice black bass, too. Uh, what I'm fishing today is a uh, 3 yard mag worm hook from Trocar. 
I know. All it is. I'll show you right now. Let me get it out. And all it is on the hook is that, uh, I'm sorry, my phone going off. At the very tip where you tie your line at it, it has somewhere that holds, see, right there, it holds the bait in place longer. And you see, I ripped it off trying to show you, but a uh, nice size bass, that is, hey, not the biggest of bass, but still a nice, beautiful bass at this pond. Mon, what's up, man? Where you at? All right, get with you on the next one. All right, bass number two on the Berkeley 7-inch power worm. A trocar mag worm hook. Give me one second. There it is. It's a little bit bigger than the last one. Size black largemouth bass. Stroke our mag worm hook, small bully weight, seven inch Berkeley power worm. On to the next one, folks. That's a camera or a recorder? It's a recorder.